Oh my, where am I? I'm in my old room! Wait a minute, the, th this used to be pink! And suddenly it's purple? Why is my bed wearing a skirt? <laughs> Look at all these cute shit. Adorable. But then I also have this box. I found this box in the garbage, but the contents inside of the box are all the things that I collected from Doki Doki box over the course of like a year. I'm home now. I'm gonna surprise sheep with a thing I bought. <laughs> a squishable! She. Why is she so thick though? Thanos unicorn. Um, so I don't really know how to go about saying this, but I woke up in a perfectly good mood today, and then I saw that today is the dreaded day. Today is December 16th. It's okay, we all have each other. Anyway, let me tell you why today is such a cursed day. And um, huge shout out to my cameraman, <clears throat> Another stuffed animal that I own. Break up with your ex. Yeah, uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, because she is abusive. Four years ago today, on December 16th, 2015, I got into my very first relationship at 11.15 p.m. Yikes. There. Flash forward three years later to December 16th, 2018, at 11.15 p.m. And that's when... I broke up with that person. The thing is, you know, I don't really want to talk about abusive relationships and shit like that and like bad, bad shit because I'm having too much fun um, with my plushies. That's how it be. I just bought her today. Well, my mom bought her today. I don't actually have money. Um, but, um, I don't, I don't know. I don't know. I need help. I don't know how to talk about this in a serious way. The point is, if it's your anniversary and y'all finna fight, you might as well just break up. I officially decided to break up with her on this day and I told her she could stay for the rest of the month, but she said, no, I'm going to leave right now, Calroy. Give me $500 for the rent. I I'm really not salty about it anymore, but you know, that was with a lot of therapy and a lot of like being consistent and taking my medication for depression and anxiety, which wasn't really caused by her. Cause you know, obviously I've always had that, but you know, if you're like constantly stressed every day you come home and you don't have like a nice comforting home to come home to, <laughs> obviously you're gonna feel like shit, like more so than usual. But anyway, with that being said, it's only recently that I've really healed from that and the biggest issue now is that maybe for like the past week i've gotten into this like new headspace which is really bad so for a while i always kept thinking like "Ooh, i'm gonna find my prince charming someday and by prince charming i mean like a good person that can talk about their feelings and uh treat me well <laughs> <laughs> i even had like a legitimate crush like two months ago and I actually confessed to him and I've never done that before. Obviously he rejected me because he was like, oh well, um, I don't see you that way. But you know, that's what I wanted because I was always like iffy about being in a relationship and I still am. Except now the actual idea of a relationship is like disgusting to me. The concept of being with someone for your whole life and it's not like an issue with monogamy or commitment. It's like, I don't think I could be interested in the same person for a really long time. And like relationships... <laughs> <laughs> Did someone call? <laughs> and relationships are fucking disgusting to me now. And I don't know what to do about it. And obviously I will be talking about this in therapy. Because the way I'm saying it right now is like a normal human thing, but that's not exactly how I feel. Like, it's a different thing, you know? I have no words for it to be able to tell my therapist. YouTube, for me, is like a practice on what I need to tell my therapist. One day, when I'm a little more comfortable talking about my past, I'm gonna go into it like hardcore. 
I'm gonna take notes. It's not gonna be like a freehand thing like I'm doing right now. God, I hate hearing myself talk. Like, no sarcasm there. I really hate hearing myself talk. So, uh, you know, um, don't forget to watch YouTube Rewind 2019. Because I'm gonna be in it. I mean, I was in it. I was the, uh, lack of cringe. I don't want to leave this vlog off on a sour note because I was just at my parents' house and I brought a whole bunch of shit that me and Sheep are gonna look through and it's gonna be fun. Maybe another day I should show you guys my Hopechan collection. Y'all know what a Hopechan is? No, you don't, because you're not a fucking weeb like I am. You're not a true gamer. You are canceled, sis. Oh, and let me show you guys. So, so, Sheep was painting yesterday, and I was doing little clay crafts, and I made this gingy bread man. I like him the most, because he He's took me very hours. very smooth. These, you don't know what these are gonna be, these three, because I haven't painted them. But I also made a pancake. And I made a cupcake. Ooh. I was kind of experimenting with uh, how to make these things because I saw someone do like the silhouette method and I liked that a lot. Today at BJ's, a young girl uh, complimented my shirt and I felt very wholesome. <laughs> Today I bring you the Doki boxes. Aw, shit. She doesn't know what she's zooming in on because it's not the actual Doki boxes. Oh, okay. But like, basically, <laughs> most of the things... So I used to... I used to be subscribed to the Doki box, like I said previously. Uh, you didn't hear me say that because I said it at my house. She. Imagine she. not being omnipresent. Can't relate. Like the bad guy. Everyone, give me your corks. Ooh. Ryan's toy review got nothing on me, kid! Yeah! I'm also a seven-year-old billionaire. <laughs> it's like an AirPod case. Aww. Bro, I love him. I love Kuchiku. him. He's one of my favorites. Kuchiku. I mean, I don't have favorites. I love all y'all equally. They're all shaking and crying. Oh, and I like him a lot. I never took him out of the package because I didn't want to get him dirty. What but a look at him! Boy. Look at look no, at look on. at him. Look at his tongue. Oh, him little mango. He doing a quirky. Oh, she's hella quirky. Oh, washi tape, beautiful. Indeed. Yes. Mmm, little. Ah, oh, little donut. Like I love everything so much. This oh, could be Nudgy. Bro, sorry, Nudgy. Is this too much doxation for you? Cause it really looks like you. Like, it really looks like you, kid. Miku! Miku! But yeah, the thing is, and this is actually one of the things, they count these as two separate items. Wait, what? And they had only the sent- The lanyard? The lanyard and then the sticker. And they had only sent like eight items that year, that week. Wait, that month? Month. So I was like, yeah, it's kind of dropping in quality. I mean, the stuff was still good, but, but like... But they were getting uh, cheaper with their... Yeah. Less generous. Yeah. Yes. Ooh, but if I got the first Doki box, I could have had a Madoka tumbler. Uh, oh! I started getting the second and on. Oh, a little Dadara Muka Daki Makura. I don't know what... Papa! Wow. What are you doing? My oh. mom also put some like separate cute shit in here. I just got doxxed. This is my uh, little clay Mikasa figurine that I made a couple Dude, of years ago. Dude, that's amazing. Oh no, people are gonna know I'm a weeb. Fuck it, dice. These two Hopechans are stuck. They literally don't come apart. I can't. They're fuck it, oh, lesbian oh, Hopechan. <laughs> I think they um like uh some heat was was no. applied to them? No, because I used to do this thing where I would take my Hopei chans and I would uh -huh. just like squish them together. Oh. Because it was fun. They did like a little suction. Yeah. But these just don't come apart. 
because I was like, oh, they're really cute together, so I left them like that. Oh, shim big. Oh, I remember him. We got them from Disney. Like, dude, I really thought I bought this with my mom like seven years ago. False memories. And if only we had an oven. Like and then here's some things that I got from the Doki box. Nice. Some things I found on the floor. Some things I bought from Book Off. Y'all like that Pikachu ass? I... Who, who came up with this concept? You see, at this point, I got so tired of editing that I just sped everything up to 3,000%. If you really want to know what has been said in these few seconds of this video playing, just slow it down yourself, loser. Yeah, we should. He chaperoned and we their could... date. Oh, no. <laughs> Come on, kids. Kiss.